He shined the shoes of everyone from Congressman Cooper to Patti LaBelle. But this weekend, a legendary shoe shiner in Nashville is finally getting his moment in the spotlight. News Channel 5's Chris Davis shows us how. You got an odd color there. Percy is a firm believer. This is probably something I'm putting on here now. That you can learn a lot about someone through their soul. Your feet tell your story about you, man. You really do. And he would know. <laughs> <laughs> because he's been shining shoes in this store for the last 30 years and has been in the business since the 1940s. 19, I was a whippersnapper, man. I was a kid. Ever since, he's rubbed elbows and the shoes of the who's who of Nashville. I, I nicknamed him Talky Talk. But it doesn't matter about your politics, passion, or profession. Everyone gets the same treatment. I treat them like they're part of the family. They treat me like I'm part of their family. One of his most loyal customers is Philip Jones. I walked in his shoe shine shop in March of 1991. Since then, he's been coming twice a week for some polish and perspective. He's got political advice, personal advice. He's just a shaman. But one day, Philip had a realization. He was getting older, and I just, at the insistence of my wife, she said, you shouldn't let his story just pass with his passing. You should tell it. So despite having no experience in making documentaries, this attorney hired a crew and got to work. Everyone in Nashville knows Percy. Making a film about Percy's life. I was raised as a man. And along the way, realized his story said a lot about Nashville, too. His shop is 100 feet away from the Woolworths where they had the sit-ins in the 60s. He grew up on Jefferson Street, which was gentrified in the 70s. If you ask Percy, Nashville's growth has moved a little too fast, especially for a man whose slogan is walk slow. Walk slow? Because if you walk fast, you might miss something. <laughs> <laughs> but then things got a little too slow March of last year. The premiere for Shine Service was canceled because of COVID-19, and then his business pretty much came to a halt. People just, they're not dressing, they're not wearing shoes, they're working at home, man. It, Ain't no, half the state workers not even here. Slowly but surely, loyal customers are trickling back in, and the 84-year-old plans to be here to greet them. I'm going to be here. I ain't going nowhere like you're tired. I ain't going nowhere. Because he's been a mainstay around Nashville. Because with his documentary finally premiering this weekend and a job he loves. I just enjoy the work. I just like uh, bring them back to life. The soul of Percy continues to shine. Because I put it on you. Don't think I won't talk to you. With photojournalist Nathan Sharkey. <laughs> she tell you, don't think I won't talk to you. Chris Davis, <laughs> News Channel 5. Yeah. Can't wait to see it. Shine Service, the film about Percy's life, will premiere at the Regal Opry Mills Theater Sunday afternoon. And for more information, you can go to our website.